Hi everybody, how are you all doing? I hope you guys are doing well. Welcome or welcome back to the channel. In this video, we are going to see what does this person really, really feel about you? The person on your mind, what are their true feelings towards you? So this is going to be an all sign reading all the way from Aries to Pisces. All right, so let's find out your person's true feelings towards you. All right, so let's see. What is Aries person's true feelings towards Aries? Wow, <laughs> this person has a lot of love for you and I see they they want to make a move towards you. Uh, some of you, this could be a water sign or it could be any sign, doesn't really matter. Uh, their true feelings towards you, they want to offer you this cup of love. You see how this person is bringing in this cup of love. So I see that there is someone definitely who's looking forward to make a move towards you. However, this person is also someone who takes a lot of time and they like introspect a lot. They are not somebody who would jump into things very quickly. This person takes their own sweet time and uh, then they come towards you. So that's that. Give me an oracle message about this person's feelings towards Aries, please. I love our intimacy. Ooh, some of you, this person loves, I'm manifesting you in my life. I definitely see that this person is manifesting you in their life. However, they are coming in so slow that it kind of makes you second guess it. You're like, is this person even coming towards me? Like, they don't show me any sign. They are, but the problem is they are like a snail, basically. You're dealing, a, dealing with a snail, all right? So you like left the whole human race and you started dating a snail. And now they're just taking their own time, all right? So that might be that. Aries, I see this person also misses your intimacy with them, obviously. Like, so you might have been intimate in the past and they missed that about you. And if you have not been intimate in the past, then I see this person kind of replace that in their mind like they they imagine about you sexually and uh, they create those visions in their mind and they would want to have that with you you know so maybe that so there's like deep attraction between the two of you give me a message for aries person's feelings towards aries aries person's feelings towards aries romantic feelings huh? this person is definitely drooling over you like there's saliva coming out of their mouth Somebody is coming in with a lot of romantic feelings. There's a deep, intense passion between the two of you. It's also emotional. You know, it's not like King of Wand or an emperor kind of a passion. That's just about sex. But this is not only about sex. It's about sex, but feelings also, emotions also. So somebody feels very deeply connected to you. And this person is definitely looking forward to like come towards you and make a move. So I, I, I definitely see someone is drooling over you, Aries. That's, that's good. That's really, really good. Now let's see for Taurus. Taurus in the house. Taurus in the house. What is Taurus person's real feelings towards Taurus? Nine of Wands. This person is very defensive. Right now you both might not be speaking. I see that there might be this no contact period going on between the two of you. And both of you are kind of waiting who will initiate the conversation first. All right. So nobody is making a move. <laughs> both of you are very, very stubborn. And you both are waiting as to who is going to drop the hat and like make a move. So that's that. Uh, give me one more for Taurus person's feelings towards them. Yeah, four of cups. There's definitely no contact period going on. Some of you, this, you think that this person has forgotten you or whatever. But see, at the backdrop, this person is waiting for you to make a move. So I see that right now you are in no contact period. There's no communication. Both of you are waiting for each other to make a move. Some of you, you feel like this person is gone and like this person is gone and this is end or whatever. That's not true. This person is like secretly observing you. This person might be stalking you actually. So they have their eyes on your moves. <laughs> I give you a message for Taurus's person's feelings towards Taurus. Taurus person's feelings towards Taurus. I tried too hard, but you did not notice. So some of you, this could be your energy or this could be their energy. One of you is definitely feeling like they did a lot and the other person did not appreciate. So now they don't want to do anything. Some of you, I see this might be your energy, right? So that might be you or maybe some of you, this person might be playing these blame games. So this person might be thinking like they have done a lot and Taurus does not appreciate. So I'm not going to do anything. So some blame games are also going on. Some of you, this person thinks that you don't notice their efforts no matter how much they do for you. You just don't notice. And you might be feeling the same about them. So <laughs> there's definitely this stiff going on between the two of you. Engagement. However, I see that um, your connection has the potential to like go to the next level but it's gonna happen with a little bit of delay and all of that like you both know that the connection is worth it and it can actually lead to something but the defensive part is coming in like both of you are very defensive and that's actually making 
it very difficult for you to take it to the next level so that is that this is what your person is feeling in the current moment taurus stubborn as fuck all right <laughs> that's what it is all right let's see messages for gemini's person's feelings towards gemini what is gemini's person feeling towards gemini eight of cups so this person thinks that gemini has walked away or this person might be walking away but this person's feelings towards you they think that you have walked away so some of you this could be a water sign that you're dealing with gemini this there's again no contact period some of you you may be having taurus placements in your chart or you may be dealing with the taurus as well i see that there's no communication period going on this person thinks that you have walked away from them you don't care about them um this person thinks that you're done with them so that could be that give me one more about this person's feelings towards taurus sorry gemini <laughs> Yeah, King of Cups and the Knight of Wands. So some of you, it could be a water sign or a fire sign. This person's feelings towards you. Um, this person still has a lot of passion towards you, definitely. Some of you, it was their friends with benefit kind of a situation. Some of you, it was this connection where this person was like... So problem here, Gemini, is that this person was not making you a priority. This person might be having other people or other situations going on in the background and they were never really coming towards you openly which is why you got pissed and you were like fuck this shit i'm not here waiting for this person however they still have a lot of passion towards you um yeah that's that this person feels very passionately driven towards you however they think that you are done with them some of it this person was really testing the waters with you like they were not deeply involved and you got pissed you were like i can't do this anymore hmm all right give me a message for gemini wedding wow some of you you might be married to this person or you wanted to get married but this person's wishy-washy behavior kind of pressed the wrong buttons for you romantic feelings there are romantic feelings between the two of you but i see the trust factor has kind of gone out of the window you don't trust this person they want to build your trust but they don't know how so that is that somebody was keeping their options open definitely or they were just very wishy-washy is what i see Gemini's person's feelings towards Gemini. I miss you. Yeah, this person is missing you. You made me take harsh decisions. Yeah, just like Taurus, I definitely feel like you guys are also in no contact period. There's like very little communication between the two of you. You might have taken harsh decisions because of this person, because how non-committal they were. This person is missing you. That's their feelings towards you. This person might have also like mirrored your behavior and they might have disconnected as well. And now they are repenting over it. So that might be that. Both of you are not talking right now. And it's taking a toll on both of you. Let's see for cancer. Cancer person's feelings towards them. What is cancer's person's feelings towards cancer? Feelings of cancer. Yeah, world car. Ooh. Somebody wants to take this connection with you uh, towards commitment. Whoever you're dealing with, some of you, it could be a, a Taurus, a Leo, Aquarius or Scorpio. This person wants to take this connection towards you to the next level, but they're coming in really slow. The move, the pace is very, very slow. Give me one more. Yeah, star card again. This person wants to build up this connection with you. They want to definitely take it to the next level. However, I see this person takes their own sweet time. You know, star card and world card, both are very slow cards in tarot. So somebody might not be moving at the pace that you want and that might be causing frustration. However, this person's feelings towards you is definitely a lot of love. So yeah, they're coming in with a lot of love. They definitely want to take it to the next level. And this person is also putting in the efforts to take it to the next level. However, they're doing it at a slow pace. So that might be a problem <laughs> for you. Um, cancer person's feelings towards cancer, please. Give me a card. You complete me. Wow. There's this soulmate energy that I feel here. You know, cancer, you might be dealing with somebody who could be a soulmate. And both of you feel that you connect, you complete each other. So there's this deep, intense connection between the two of you. And there's this undeniable chemistry between the two of you. And both of you want to take it to the next level, you know like you want that if you are dating you should like end up together that kind of thing you know married and all of that all right give me a message for cancer please message for cancer what do we have love yourself first some of you you also need to love yourself first 
so bring in some self love like if you don't love your own self you will keep on reflecting that from the outside world and you will keep on coming across people who like don't move towards you as fast so some of you if you are asking yourself as to why this person is not coming towards you really really quickly the the problem could be that you lack on self love you don't love yourself and you feel like only somebody from the outside can come and like heal you so your message is to not rely upon other people for your happiness first focus on yourself love yourself first keep up with your self respect do not bend over backward for people and all of that and i see then things will fall in place also let go of control issues i see that you're trying to control your life like you're trying to control the pace you want to accelerate something just know that it's not possible you cannot accelerate the process of life you have to go with the flow okay so release the control and then things will happen for you cancer all right let's see for leo leo person's feelings towards leo what is leo person's true feelings towards leo leo's person's feelings towards leo please five of swords oh this is a cheater here <laughs> fuck who the fuck are you dealing with leo this might be a person who is a manipulator is a cheater it could be a gemini libra aquarius that you're dealing with give me one more you're definitely oh shit you're dealing with an idiot you're dealing with a toxic narcissistic person full of shit trying to cheat you trying to plot against you you really need to be very careful about this person i see that they might try to come back and wrap you up in words and manipulate you some of you this person was using you sexually or they want to use you sexually be very very careful yeah it's time for you to like not pay heed to this person some of you i also see that this person's karma is hitting them back so somebody might have played games with you they were very manipulative and narcissistic in the past and this person's karma is hitting them back right now this person is still not changed they might try to come back and manipulate you again be very careful very very careful this is like a satan that you're dealing with like literally i right, give me a message for leo person's feelings towards leo i don't want to accept the reality yeah this person is someone who does not want to accept the reality like this person lives in an illusion of their own they have their own freaking dream world <laughs> and they don't want to see the reality they live in illusion and they want you to live in illusion with them they want to keep you in illusion so be very careful this is an idiot here like really give me two months time some of you this person would ask time from you and they will tell you things like you know i'm going to change myself and please give me a second chance don't your message is don't you know give me a message for leo person feeling so as leo please retreat yep it's time to disconnect from the world the best that you can do right now is to retreat from this person this is a satan there waiting for you <laughs> just retreat from this idiot like really this this is not the time to connect with this person this person is full of shit really leo like really that's your message fuck that was a toxic reading what can i do i'm sorry but this person is an idiot i can't do anything about it you know all right let's see leo done uh what is the next sign virgo virgo what is virgo person's feelings towards virgo the true feelings towards virgo please Ace of Cups. Wow, they want to make you an offer. Some of you, this could be a water sign, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. They want to make you an offer. They love you. They want to indulge in that emotional talks with you. Give me one more. This person's true feelings towards Virgo. The High Priestess with the King of Wands. Some of you. Wow, somebody wants to share a secret with you. This person loves you a lot. First of all, and they like really, really want to connect with you, and they want to make you an offer. Uh, King of Wands is also somebody's ego is getting in the way. So this person loves you a lot. There's a lot of feelings involved here, but the problem is somebody's ego. This person's ego keeps coming in the way, and they don't let it move this person towards you like completely. So that might be that. But however, I see there's a lot of love. There's somebody coming forward with the communication towards you. Uh, this person wants to like make you an offer. So there's definitely a love offer coming in from someone. could be an air sign water sign some of it could also be a fire sign a lot of passion and a lot of emotion coming in from this person virgo this person really want to like sweep you off your your feet <laughs> they want to express their feelings to you some of you this person also wants to share a secret with you that could be their hidden feelings and emotions wow somebody is in love give me a message for virgo this could be the one some of you this person could be the one for you wow and there's heart to heart conversation i definitely feel like somebody is coming towards you and they want to 
um, they want to tell you the secret and they want to like openly confront their feelings towards you and they want to like uh, have this heart to heart with you like this person is going to talk to you like never before they really want to do that and some of it this person could be the one for you so there's this intense chemistry between the two of you here is what I see and give me a message for Virgo's person's feelings towards Virgo what do we do now this person is thinking what do I do <laughs> this person does not know how to come towards you but they do want to come do you miss me this person is asking whether you, whether you miss them they miss you but they are not sure if you also miss them i want to be alone for a while so our converse our connection is worth waiting for so i see that right now you both might not be speaking that's why obviously they're looking for a new beginning and they're looking for new communication however um i see that you have both taken a break from each other for some time but this person now wants to come towards you and like make you an upfront offer somebody is having a lot of love for you here and they want to have this heart to heart with you it's cute that's really really good so work well done libra yeah libra libra let's see for libra hold on a second what is libra person's feelings towards libra libra's person's true feelings towards libra please wow the sun card so this person has a lot of emotions towards you they want to have good times with you um this person is looking for good and happy times with you some of you this person also wants to go on a vacation with you maybe by the beach or something yeah three of cups somebody is looking forward for happy times with you for some sort of a celebration or whatever this is, the person is looking for a reconciliation as well they might have walked away from you maybe they were the one who disconnected or whatever but i see this person stalks you and they are looking for a new beginning this person also wants to go on a vacation with you so maybe that is that somebody is like like this person is very sure that you and them make a really good couple and like they want to be with you like that's it like there's no other discussion no other confusion they want you that's it that's what it is <laughs> and this person is also secretly planning in their mind as to how they will go on a vacation with you or how they will have the celebration moment with you or whatever this person might be stalking your social media if you are on social media uh, give me Libra person's feelings towards Libra, please. Free yourself. Yeah, so I see this person might have walked away from you, uh, but like this person is the one for you. <laughs> so this is somebody who walked away from you and like they were not talking to you or whatever, but now they are realizing how you were always there for them. So some of you, this person might have like deceived you, maybe. They, they brought in a lot of chaos in the situation there was codependency issues or maybe this person was having some addiction problems or whatever some of you this person had some red flags and that they got exposed to you but i see somebody has changed and they want to come come back and come correct somebody wants to correct their mistakes libra that's what i see give me a message for libra person's feelings towards libra please i miss you yeah this person is missing you of course they are regretting whatever they did to you we need this time apart from each other for the best yeah that's what exactly i was saying so this person might have like walked away from you because they thought that the grass is greener on the other side or whatever but then now they realize after separating from you that's when they realized how much you mean to them and how much you did for them and how nobody is going to do that for them so they are regretting whatever they did and they like want to come correct is what i see all right so that's for libra let's see for scorpio Scorpio. Let's see. What is Scorpio person's feelings towards Scorpio? True feelings of Scorpio's persons towards Scorpio. Ten of Swords. Ooh, this person thinks that this has come to an end. Some of you, this person thinks that this is over between the two of you. King of Wands. Somebody's ego is also getting in the way. So this person wants to come towards you. They have a lot of passion. But I see somebody's ego is getting in the way. Some of you, you may have had a sudden ending with them. Like you could just not see it coming towards you. This person might have ghosted you out of nowhere. And you're like confused as to why they did whatever they did. So you're trying to figure out that. That's what I see. This person's next action towards Scorpio though. Ace of Cups. <laughs> 
they want to come towards you by the way so yeah at one point i see that this connection might have ended and you both are not speaking somebody's ego and controlling nature is also coming in between this person likes to take control in their cha in their hand and you don't like to be dominated so that might be a problem between the two of you however there's a lot of passion this person's next action towards you is the ace of cups so they're looking for a, for a reconciliation between the two of you um they would like to make you an offer is what i see let's let's see scorpio person's feelings towards scorpio i'm sorry yep apology coming in i see there's an apology coming in from somebody who has deeply hurt you that's what it is give me one more scorpio person's feelings to you are my twin flame some of you this is a twin flame soulmate shit going on here between the two of you you might have disconnected from each other in the past a couple of times but you always bounce back so that is the case between the two of you nevertheless i see somebody is coming in with an apology yep somebody who might have ended things with you abruptly they miss you they want to come back and this is a twin flame soulmate situation going on this this is like a pattern that happens between the two of you is what i see scorpio person's feelings towards scorpio please calling in your soulmate some of you this person is manifesting you like they would manifest but not call <laughs> okay give me one more express your love and we have getting to know each other some of you this person is like expressing their love to you and i also see that you might indulge in some deep conversation with each other and you will like get to know each other really better now so that might be that some deep intense conversation is coming in for you scorpio and also an apology from someone who abruptly disconnected from you so yeah scorpio done sagittarius next right sagittarius what is sagittarius person's feelings towards sagittarius true feelings of sagittarius person the the justice card somebody wants to right the wrong this person wants to balance this situation with you maybe it was a very one sided connection in the past now they want to balance some of you this person wants to get married to you because you know justice card is a legal agreement and marriage is also a legal contract so i see somebody wants to like sign this legal contract with you they want to get married to you uh i also see some of you this could be like a new connection that you both are having um or maybe you are trying to build a new foundation so that might be that star card is like building a new foundation and then 10 of cups is like taking it to the ultimate goal so somebody is planning for a long term connection with you some of you this person might be somebody that you knew from the past so it could be that or it could be a friend or an acquaintance that is showing a lot of interest in you and it's not a mumbo jumbo thing like they really want to have a balanced connection with you and they want to take it to the next level So yeah somebody's putting in the effort <laughs> they're trying to balance the scale with you they want to take it to the next level with you Right give me message for li for for Sagittarius I'm sorry <laughs> you might be dealing with a Libra because you have the Libra card here Libra or Aquarius or a water sign Right give me message for Sagittarius person feeling to a Sagittarius I want to have babies with you. Didn't I tell you this? Like somebody wants to get married, they want to have a stable connection with you, they want to marry you, they want to have stability with you, they want to have a family with you. So I see all of that. Give me one more. I'm sorry I disconnected from you. Yeah. Some of you this person might have disconnected from you if it's a past person and they're sorry for that. They might have disconnected with you at the most vulnerable time of yours and they're apologetic. I definitely see somebody wants to right the wrong. That's the energy that I see here. Somebody wants to right the wrong that they have done. Okay? They want to give justice to you. Give me message for Sagittarius person's feelings towards Sagittarius. New love. There's new love coming in. Wow. Worth waiting for. Some of you it's a past person coming back and you have waited for them for a long time and now it's like it's worth waiting for. It was worth waiting for. So you might have waited for a really long time and like now it's happening and you're like okay it was worth waiting. So that is that. Sagittarius. Now let's see for Capricorn. Capricorn. What is Capricorn person's true feelings towards Capricorn? Knight of Cups with the Ten of Wands. Somebody wants to make you an offer, but they are also very overburdened as to how can they do that. Some of you, this person is 
taking their own sweet time because they have a lot of other things going on in their life so they might be overburdened with responsibilities career situation financial situation whatever but they 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 definitely have love for you some of you this person is not making a move towards you because they think you are very busy so that might be that this person's true feelings towards you they want to make you an offer what else yeah and i know one somebody is very defensive like this person is not showing you exactly how much they love you but they love you a lot is what i see some of you may also see that this person is unnecessarily stubborn and unnecessarily defensive like they can they can tell this to you and they can like make it clear but this person is unnecessarily going to stretch it making it really seem very difficult unnecessary unnecessary chaos that this person is creating capricorn give me a message to capricorn person's feelings towards capricorn capricorn person's feelings towards capricorn Will you please listen to me? Yeah, <laughs> Capricorn. Some of you, this person thinks that you are very stubborn. Like you are the stubborn person, busy person. So they don't know if you will listen to them. What are you doing to make this person feel like that? They want you to listen to them. All right, that's what I see. Give me one more for Capricorn. This person's feelings towards Capricorn. We are destined to be together. Ooh. <laughs> so yeah, you might be stubborn or. You might not be talking to each other or giving each other so much so time, but I see this person is still very stubborn on the fact that both of you are destined to be together and they will make it up to you somehow. No matter how much you try to pretend like I'm busy, I don't have time, but they will be with you. Give me a message for Capricorn person's feelings towards Capricorn, please. Honeymoon and playfulness. They want to have some good times with you. They want to take you on vacation or they just want to like spend some time away from all this busy, busy, not busy, busy schedule of yours or theirs or whatever. Somebody is looking forward to have good times with you. They want to like recapture these sweet innocent moments with you. They want to have some good times with you. They want to build memories with you is what I see. Hmm. <laughs> some of you, there's also vacation in your future or you will spend time together is what I see. That's about Capricorn. Now let's see Aquarius. Aquarius. The second last sign. Okay, what is Aquarius person's feelings towards Aquarius, please? Aquarius person's feelings towards Aquarius. Page of Wands. Wow. Some of you, this person is trying to find a new idea in which they can like come towards you make you an offer this person is also trying to like bring back the passion the spark in the connection so maybe the spark has gone out between the two of you and they're trying to like rekindle that some of you if you are not talking to each other whatever this person is trying to look for ways in which they can like do something and approach you so they're trying to look for ways in which they can approach you give me one more they want to relive those moments with you yeah queen of cups there's this deep intense passion that this person feels for you some of you also see that this person does not show you exactly how much you mean to them or how much they love you so they have like hidden feelings and emotions for you so that's that but i see that they are looking forward to like make a move towards you and they're trying to find an up find an idea to do so the connection might have become a little monotonous and they want to like bring the spark back I give me a message for Aquarius person's feelings towards Aquarius. You made me take the harsh decisions. So you might have taken a harsh decisions. This person, I'm working hard to bring you all the happiness. So I see that some of you, you might have done something <laughs> or said something which has hurt this person's ego and they might have disconnected from you. So maybe that was that or, or something happened because of which the spark between the two of you kind of went off so that's that however i see this person is like working hard to like as i said they're working hard they're trying to find ways in which they can like come back and like make it happen or whatever this person is also trying to hide their feelings they have a lot of feelings <laughs> they are trying to hide it but i see it'll be very evident to you give me a message for aquarius person's feelings towards aquarius you deserve love they think that you deserve love and they want to give it to you flirt yeah i keep seeing that i keep seeing some of you there was deception involved maybe i don't know this person might have cheated you 
or they were they were involved with someone else and you got to know about it maybe that was that so yeah i see that this person definitely knows that you deserve love and they want to give it to you and i keep seeing that this person is like trying to come back and like bring back the spark and like flirt with you and like you know they just want to keep the energy very very light and they want to bring that fun element back in the connection which has become very monotonous so that is that it's good let's see for pisces pisces person's feelings towards pisces so last but not the least pisces person's feelings towards pisces queen of pentacles wow they want to give you the stability this person thinks really high of you some of you you might be like very successful that also makes them a little insecure is what i see however i see somebody is like looking forward to connect with you this person thinks very high of you this person knows that they are very mature or you already have a lot of things going for you so like why would you care for them some of you this person might be a little insecure is what i see uh yeah the justice card so i see this person wants to like bring back the balance in the connection even out some of you this person knows that you have done a lot for them in the past and now they want to like give it back to you so maybe that is that they want to balance the scale i also see that right now you might be in a no contact period there's no communication or very limited communication but this is changing with the wheel of fortune like things are shifting some of you you are like confused you don't know what's up and you feel like this is over but it's not over things are shifting between the two of you and the communication is going to be restored and some of you this person is trying to like level up and mature up and like come up on your level they feel that pisces is like too good to be true and like why will pisces care for me so they might be a little insecure as well pisces person's feelings towards pisces i miss you we need this time apart from each other yeah for the best so some of you you definitely are in no contact period or there's this separation that has happened between the two of you are very limited communication and this was actually a time for this person to reflect upon whatever happened in the past so that they can come correct and like they can come more prepared so maybe that so this time apart actually has brought in some revelation in this person's life and i see this person is missing you like they are missing your absence and it's like absence makes the heart grow fonder kind of a situation going on here right so that is that give me a message for pisces person speaking towards pisces so we have honeymoon and children some of you this person wants to take you on a vacation they want to go on a vacation with you something like that some of you there could be uh, children involved in the situation so maybe you are married or whatever or otherwise this person was behaving like a child you know we had page of one so this person is behaving very childish but now they want to they want to show up as a mature person and they want to like come correct and like come mature towards you is what i see so yeah good energy is ahead for you pisces i'm trying to reach out to you somebody's like trying to reach out to you have you blocked this person or what i don't know <laughs> they're trying hard to like come to you connect to you or whatever so yeah but that's pretty much your readings all the signs what your person feel about you so let me know how it resonated and i will see you in the next video you guys take care stay safe bye